All right, right now we have uh, three quarters and a half. If Maine is known for anything. And squeeze. It's this. And there you go. Wherever you go in the world, people always talk about Maine lobsters, so. But to get the meat, you've got to get past the mess. Yeah, the inside and the eyeballs. <laughs> this, this is pretty cool. This is different. That's where John Hathaway comes in and his two-story, 80,000-pound lobster shucker. I've been looking in the lobster business for something different and unique, and I thought, wow, that's it. People call it naked lobster. We, we call it, I'm too sexy for my shell. <laughs> Using extreme water pressure, the machine quickly kills the lobster and detaches the muscle from the shell, so the meat literally slides right out. I mean, you can see that right there. There's, not, there's nothing left on there. It all started 10 years ago when Hathaway opened a restaurant. I can boil water, so I figured, okay, everybody comes to town and they want lobster dinner. I, I, I was shocked. People didn't want that experience. They wanted us to take the meat out for them. They wanted lazy man lobster. When his kids spent most of their summers shucking lobsters for tourists, he wondered if there was a way to bring convenience to the crustacean. There was a huge opportunity in value-added Maine lobster that wasn't being met. At the time, the technology was being used in Louisiana to kill Vibrio and oysters when they were surprised to find a useful side benefit. When he opened the oyster, the, the bivalve had been cut by the water pressure. Okay. So you didn't have to shuck the oyster anymore. Hathaway hopped on a plane and tested it out with lobsters. It was like, wow, I didn't know it was going to do this, right? He says it's revolutionizing the industry. Shipping live lobsters is difficult and costly. Pre-cooked lobster isn't preferred by most chefs for a luxury food. But Hathaway's water pressure kills any bacteria, allowing him to ship raw lobster meat anywhere in the world. That's great for a high-end restaurant, but if you're talking about a place like this, but part of it is you got to get dirty, you got to smell like the lobster after. Although some restaurants prefer the old-fashioned way. All right, there's no way you can do that with either a live or a cooked lobster. It's an industry that's feeling the pressure to slip out of its shell.